good, and yep. Gabe, you know, very seasoned uh, Smash player. Yeah. PGR too, so it's not a bad I mean, loss at all. No, not at all. And Sandy played very well in it. I think it's a bit of a hard matchup too, I would imagine. So it's, it's weird for sure, but. Let's get into this match now. We've got 605 Skittles versus TGO this is, this Zen. Is, this is a classic for Nebraska right here. It this is. is. This is like something you would probably see in Grands like a couple years ago. Mm-hmm. It's a very pre-COVID grit like like match right now. Right. And like I expect this match to go pretty fast actually. Yeah. Like Zen, he definitely has his moments where he likes to slow down the pace, keep it slow. Yeah. Um, but Tanner doesn't really give him the room uh, True. to do that. Or Skittles, sorry. Yeah. Right, no, you're, we're, we're good We're here. on a first name basis, whatever. I've, it's like the Midwest is tuned into this. The Midwest knows who Tanner is. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Um, but yeah, Town and City, um, I don't, I think Zen probably just wants to kind of control the space the same way that Skittles does. And uh, if I can take some, uh, what I heard about the set between Zen and Brady, uh, yeah. Zen was not going for the edge guards. Um, so he might just want to play this like neutral game here on stage uh, against Skittles. True. I mean, he maybe should be because he Whoa. did give up stage control there, but oh, gets the back throw and finds the kill with it. Yeah, those blast zones are brutal, especially with that flat assist here. This is definitely one uh, kill move away, a very fast and safe kill move. That, that is one thing about Young Lane. Yep. That up air, that down air, crazy. Anyways. A lot of fast and a lot of safe moves mm -hmm. for both the characters, to be fair, though. Yeah, these two players, um, they can be they can be very different from each other, but right now they're, they're definitely playing the same game. Yeah. Oh, and Skills fishing for this kill right now, just trying to get a fair up tilt, almost going to do it, but that top blast on the ceiling is actually huge on yeah. Town and City. And Ooh. fair, good air dodge from Zen, going to avoid that, and just racking up some percent. Good extra credit oh right now, almost dying. Yeah, I just like surprised. sweet spot in air across the stage, that's, almost doing it for a throw. That's smart. <laughs> that kind of attack sparked. That's nuts. It sparked and it yeah, killed. Yeah, crazy spacing <laughs> right now. Real. Oh, goodness. Uh, Skittles right now, just taking it slow and kind of retreating back to the, uh, the ledges here. Um, getting some damage at center stage here. Very slowly encroaching on each other, the two of them. I think they're both kind of looking for reversals when they when they are choosing and opting to go to the ledge instead. Yeah. Because like, this stage it can just be so volatile. Again, with those, those side blast zones, if you yeah. just get one reversal, 40, 50 percent, it's completely, that's like totally. game, you know? And I mean, that's exactly how Zen took his first stock, right? It right. was on that platform like found the grab at the right time and got the back throw and that would have killed in any other situation yeah. except for like in that on that platform right and skittles coming in clutch with the down tilt spot dodge classic that fair again on the flat great assist to get that kill when zen is looking for it oh, this platform is, is a lot of having a lot of play right now yeah like, true yeah like a good 40% of play on just that platform. True. I mean, I think both of these characters that are, are, are sometimes like at too high a percents can struggle to kill. And so I think just like being th that platform just gives them the edge they need to find those kind of kills. Oh, yeah. Air dodge and the bomb. Going deep and makes Bombs it back. Do it, yeah. I think if Zen didn't hit him there, he might have just been too low even after the bomb. I could be wrong. Um, no, I think you're right. But that's crazy. Uh, Zen at 76%. Ooh, Skittles. Yeah. Nice extra credit right now. Pikachu can wrap that up so, so quickly yeah. with the uh, the lightning loops. Ooh. Good air dodge, but Zen is going to keep air dodging there. Skittles is going to catch on. Ooh, looking for, again for the up air. Is the up air going to do it? Looking for the oh, down air. Oh, yeah, I, th I thought that was maybe what he was fishing for. That is a Skittles classic. Yep. It's, yep, it, there, there it is. There we go. I wish we had like a... Um, like Panda could do some stats on like how many kills uh, Tanner gets. Skittles well, yeah, gets that would with be downer. Sick. I, I bet it would it would maybe be in the top three for sure. Yeah. Maybe top two. I need like a JMOOC style analysis video on right. Skittles down air. So we have kind of a, a an interesting loser's side of things here because uh, Skittles did get upset by Rafa earlier today. Yeah, and, uh, a hot set. Yeah. That's a hot set. And then on the other side, Gabe got upset by... Welfare uh, Pickles. Welfare Pickles, yeah. 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 The room, they, the room they went know crazy who for that. Pickles was, and, and he learned fast. That is unranked Iowa Snake yeah. number number three. Yeah. Just kidding. Well, Pickles is actually really good. I think he's like four or five right now in, in a 
Iowa? Yeah. Well, regardless, we can talk about them later when we see them on stream. Right now we've got Skittles versus Zen, and this edge guard's so close to not making it back, but Skittles back on stage. Just gonna hold center. Pikachu kind of just gets off a ledge for free with uh, that quick attack. Yeah. Good spot dodge, but Zen waiting it out here. Oh my god. Whoa, whoa. That's nice. playing pretty hot right now, I'll be real. Mm -hmm. He's playing very reactionary, yeah. um, and I think you need to against Young Link. Especially if you have the, the speed to contest him. Absolutely. Good way Zen there. always struck me as a reactionary. Sorry. <laughs> Dumb joke. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. For all you commies out there. Yeah. Hey, just, yeah, kidding. just kidding. I love capitalism. Anyways, uh, <laughs> red, white, and blue, right? Oh, we are at center stage and it's wow. gonna get up smashed. Up air! Oh, okay, stick. just the, the safe there instead. But some really fast damage being tacked on from Skittles there. This happens a lot. You see Tanner go down like 100%, and then he's like, wait a minute, I need to actually play. He just goes like Super Saiyan <laughs> randomly yeah. and just like completely reverses the entire situation. Yeah, but the set with, with Rafa was very similar to that too. True, yeah. we might, so we might be seeing something kind of similar here. Down tilt, Oof. up air, not gonna do it. Zen, living by the skin of his teeth Oof. right now, but Tanner is not much farther from that, that dash tag. So strong. So strong. Almost killed earlier as well, and then that time is definitely going to do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice punish opportunity. Oh, and I think he might have been waiting out the air dodge there, but Zen just going to jump away instead. Yeah. Good adaptation here. Is Skittle's going to be able to remember that for next time? Play the mix-up. Uh -huh. Back throw. Not going to do it just yet. Holy moly, 156%. What do you see? Pikachu live that long. He's almost at 200. 161. Yeah. Up tilt will do it. Dash attack will do it. I, I think this is, is actually where Young Link struggles to kill is when the, their opponent is at this high of a percent. Because mm -hmm. then like the arrow stuff, you know, arrow, arrow, it doesn't really true confirm into exactly. like fair anymore. And and I think Zen is taking a really good advantage of that. Um, yeah, he's kind of got like Young Link itis right now. At yeah. this percent, it's going to be so hard. And look at all this extra credit, because not only is Zen avoiding the follow up, but he's playing so slippery. Yeah. Second, and okay, I, I, thought, I got scared. I, yeah. Yeah. I thought it was going to maybe be a, a, an ultimate buffer moment there, but yeah. Tanner does not fall for it. Oh my goodness. And Skittles right now are okay. finally going to be able to get that down air kill. Just landing straight on him. Oh. Skittles probably Zen's in it react to that. Right. Um, but still so much extra credit. He doesn't really have to worry right now. There's a lot of room for him to work with. Yeah. Zen still being the aggressor in these situations. Up smash? Not yet. This is surprisingly know. weak up smash. Um, she makes it up with dash attack instead though. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Fair. Really good catch with the fair. Mm -hmm. Zen with a full stock lead. And I feel like we might see Zen go into camping mode now. He might yeah. pitch the tent here. Exactly. But Skittle's able to find his way in and get 40%. Yeah, Skittle's definitely setting up a uh, shop here at center stage. This is exactly where you want to be. But Zen is not having it. He is not approaching unless he has to. Yeah. And he's finding these, uh, like these back air strings just when he needs them, too. Oh my gosh, great extension there. Just that extra little tally of damage mm -hmm. with the up air. Really, really optimal play from Zen. Yeah. Skittle's kind of getting a bit of a mountain to climb here. You can definitely find the kill with like a, maybe like one or two more combos. Right. Um, but Zen is playing really good. Just yeah. came out from a hot set against Radiac. Yeah, it's, it's oh, that's it. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. I was going to say, it's, it's amazing how well he's able to uh, switch up between the two modes. He's playing like very yeah. campy, very slow against Radiac, but uh, super aggro and just like really oh, safe too. Hot on that. Skittles, yeah. What? Wow. Mm, that is so weird. Sometimes you have like that roll distance and you end up behind them, but then yeah. the, the body blocking like pushes you forward. I hate that mechanic yeah. so much. I don't know if it's a mechanic, but I hate that interaction. Oh my goodness. Right. And Zen immediately just going back to playing cat and mouse. Yep. And he's definitely the mouse right now. That is true. Yep, up there. Good reactions and just finding all of these T jolts yeah. in that fair. That's such good conditioning there with those T jolts. Conditioning out that, that uh, full hop and winds it perfectly with the fair. Yeah. But it is a big stage. Mm-hmm. And then doing a good job Ooh. of avoiding these arrows too. Yeah. Good air dodge there from Tanner. And he's got to find a way in now. Mm -hmm. And it's so hard with this amount of electricity in the air. I know. Ooh, nice. nice. Spot dodge, Ooh. not getting grabbed. Yeah, good frame trap. Oh my gosh. Wow. Off the side too. Whoa. I like that mix-up from Zen. 
knowing that Tanner is going to be like fishing for, for an up air again and uh, and just coming down aggressively with that down air taking the stock. So. Yeah, I mean, a lot of the other situations where he was kind of like that in this set so far, he's been either air dodging or jumping away, kind of choosing that safe defensive True. option. True, yeah. Um, but just like immediately like switching it up right when you need to. That's I mean, that's like kind of the mark of a good player too is that they, they have their... They have their conditioning or otherwise, like, they know that someone's going to start catching on, but they don't use it until, like, the time is right. Instead yeah. of just using it and just, like, totally. you know, first stock or first you Got to keep that in the back pocket. For yeah, sure. for when it really counts. Yeah. Um, yeah, really good stuff so far. 1-1 one, one between Skittles and Zen. Yep. And uh, what, what, this is losers round seven? Like, yeah. <laughs> like, this is this Grands at, like, last Wednesday, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I think this is for sixth, and that's wild. Yeah. I'm saying one of these guys would be making sixth. Let's Ooh. see who it's gonna be. I mean, this battlefield counter pick seems to be coming in clutch right now for uh, Skittles. Yeah. Um, yeah, I always thought this was kind of a weird young link stage, but Skittles uh, affirmed that it's actually not that bad, and that he is kind True. of like he kind of likes it now. No, I, I I believe that, especially in this matchup. I think because especially from what like we saw, ooh, nice stuff. Ooh. Good catch. Yeah, nice stuff. Like from from in that last set with no platforms and it's such a big stage, I feel like Tanner's really gonna um, find success from being able to, you know, stay under some platforms. Um, right. Gives you a way to get away from key jolts too if you need to. I think so too. But Zen, if he just plays from center stage, really, there's nothing he has to worry about yeah. I mean, except you know making this stock deficit. But if he can get back there, that's <laughs> definitely something that he'd be able to do. But yeah, funny little interaction here. Yeah, the old do it again. Right. Mm, Zen getting greedy off stage, looking yeah. for these edge guards here, but each time just kind of getting put in disadvantage because that down tilt upper just barely didn't do it. Is that gonna kind of like Pavlov's dog Zen into not doing that again? We'll right. see. That's it. Yep, arrow into fair. See, Strong. that's like. If as long as Tanner doesn't miss the like kind of sweet spot for like when Arrow leads into into like fair, he does not struggle. But yeah. like he really struggles if he gets Zen to like 140. And Pikachu is kind of a weird character combo because he can pancake, he's floaty, he's yeah. like small, and just sometimes his hurtbox is just not where his model is. Right. Oh and my goodness, that F smash. If it was just space a little bit better, I think that would have done it. Probably. Um, but yeah. still very close here. Skittles, three stocks. I didn't even realize yeah. <laughs> the stocks right now. Oh, this is crazy. He's big chilling. And Zen has definitely got a bit of a mountain to climb. Dash attack, super close, but this entire uh, blast zone for this stage is huge. Yep. Lucky for the drag down into the grab. Not going to find it just yet. I think Zen is just going to get most mileage if he's able to find like a T-Jolt into back air, yeah, too, or a skull, a skull bash. Uh, no, dash attack. My fault, my fault. Really creative recovery there from Tanner. Oh, yeah, this is this is the Tanner classic too. When he's up this much, he loves just kind of stalling out at that ledge. Mm -hmm. Finding the up air pretty deep through stage. I'm surprised that hit. Side B. Miss impact? Back that air. No, not 173 percent yeah, kills shocked. right now. And with rage even. And he's stalling. He's taking more percent. Oh my god. And he's <laughs> then saved him. He did, yeah. But yeah, this is that Stalin we were talking about before. <laughs> Yo, Stalin? <laughs> Yo, st for the coffees out there? <laughs> again, again, red, uh, white, and blue. Sorry, uh, sorry. Stalin versus reactionary. Oh, for real, for real. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, yeah, he is running. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I'm smart, he's gonna do it. Oh my god, look at him go. Holy, dude, his eyes are so red. It's <laughs> like terrifying. <laughs> it's like when you do it, like... <laughs> Jump scare. <laughs> jump scare. Uh, you're like outside taking That's on the trash. That's my controller, by the way. Is it really? Guy, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's cute. It looks like the uh, Arizona tea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that what it's supposed to be? Uh, it definitely, I think, is probably inspired by that, and that's that's why I bought it. Yeah, it's, it's I like cute that for design. Sure. Yeah, it's got a nice color scheme. It actually matches his jacket. Not like matches, but like it looks yeah, good. Yeah, it's like the brown with that, I think, is good. Yeah, good neutral color to go with like a little vivid top. Anyways. Back Enough of the, the style. Yeah, I know. Now to the movement. Let's let's see what they got here. Yeah, let's see for sure. 2-1. All I right, think, town. Yeah, it was like really surprising because it looked like Zen was doing really good, but then you looked at the stocks. Um, it was yeah. just kind of strange. Um, just kind of losing where it, it mattered, um, but doing well otherwise. Uh, we'll have to see if Zen's able to pull it out um, yeah. and, and bring it home. But right now, Skittles... 
doing a good job keeping some percent, but Zen is gonna answer back with a combo of his own. Whoa, yeah. SDI or just falling out? We'll it's funny know. with the with the stage list that we have. It almost seems like in like every set I've watched today, it's like because we have so many big stages that are legal. It's, yeah. it's all been like a counter pick war between small stage to big stage to small stage to big stage. Yeah. And yeah. it's like, that's like what it's all kind of boiled down to is like, did you get your counter pick at the right time? Yeah, I agree. I think I'm also, it's kind of like nice to not see all PS2. It's fun to see the stage yeah. counter picks because um, you see a lot of different interactions too. But this yes. is one interaction I wasn't looking forward to seeing is then platform camping yeah. off the side. <laughs> Very interactive gameplay happening right now, but this is super close. I mean, next stock or like next hit could be this uh, first stock. Yeah. Let's see here, both at 120-ish percent. Whoa, looking for the up air and the back throw. Good turnaround grab. Was that allowed to pick this stage? Isn't there a DSR? Um, modified. Okay. So it'll be the starter. You're allowed to go back to the starter. Okay, gotcha. In the air and just falling with that nair. Good stuff for the reversal. And oh, parries on parries. Okay. Um, well, both of them just sticking to center because neither of them want to be so close to that side blast zone at the ledge here. Skittles pivot grabbing on accident. Uh, not super huge punish from Zen, but yeah. that down air is going to get uh, a kill for Zen. 147% though. I mean, it's kind of what we talked about before too. It's like this is the kind of this area where Youngling can struggle to find the kill. Mm -hmm. so we'll see if Zen maybe tries to push his advantage here. Yeah, he just needs to call it like a jump with one fair or uh, right. obviously like the downer kills that, that Skittles likes. Um, yeah. But finding it can be so hard when people are just staying grounded, staying in shield. I mean like, what does Youngling do oh. against shield sometimes? So yeah. Besides like back and forward throw, which is not going to kill for a minute now. Yeah. Unless you're like right at ledge, which both of these players holding center so <laughs> hard that neither one can yeah. get near each other. <laughs> I, I love, okay, there it is. Yeah, up throw. I loved how that platform swooped in just in time for Zen to do a little bit of platform camping though. I know. <laughs> well, thank God you're here. <laughs> no, but he's playing He's playing good. Like, yeah. you, if you don't need to approach Young Link, like, why would you? Right. And it can be so hard to get in. You really have to take it slow. You have to be incremental with how you get in against Young Link right now because he's got range both in the grab and obviously the projectiles. He can scrap so well, my yeah. goodness. Uh, up B. Gonna get a little bit of a boomerang. Ooh, nice, nice parry on the down tilt, yeah. but not a whole lot off of it. Present. Just kind of retreating. Um, don't want to. Uh, even when you do parry Young Link, sometimes he's just. He still has the frame data yeah. for the down air. The Skittles classic up air, close. No cigar. Ooh. And Zen, yes, just holding on to the ledge here. You're really gonna have to work. Never mind. I was about to say you have to work <laughs> to find center stage, but Pikachu just kind of zip zaps up there. Zip zap. Yep. You can just quick attack over there Ooh. sometimes. I can't believe that there was not enough hits on that, but Nair is gonna do it. There's that classic there Nair, a Nair, Nair. I can Nair three times in one jump. That, yeah, that is crazy. <laughs> oh, Ooh, multi -hit. nice. Yep, that should yeah. do it. It's the drag down into the down smash. The, kind of a Pikachu classic. Right. Great. We really hadn't seen Zen use that before in the set, too, so no, good not timing for it. I think Youngling can be kind of weird to combo as well, just because he's so little, and obviously he has huge room for reverse potential yeah. with like, his Nair and his Bear being so fast. Right. So Zen just kind of like opting to take like his one, two, maybe three hit combos for the most part. Um, just got to kind of see what he can do here at 89%. This is looking really scary. Whoa, Skittles kind of baiting us out with some empty movement. Arrow Nair, so close to death. Recovery. Oh, and he's waiting for the roll. And Zen does kind of have like a roll habit at ledge. Yeah. Um, if he's not using like up to let up to center, he's definitely rolling. Ooh. Oh, that's scary. Looking for the sweet spot on that thunder, not quite mm -hmm. finding it, but does find some ledge trapping here. Skittles able to regain center stage. Yeah. Much more comfortable there. You're not going to die Ooh. too early. Yeah, don't overextend here. Just keep your oh. cool. Up throw. Oh, and no finds it there. Way. Third time's the charm on the thunder. That's why he did it twice before, because yeah. he knew the third time would work. That's so true. Yeah, it's actually free like, if you do it on, if you do it uh, twice. Yeah, he had to cycle first. through. Yeah. Exactly. Oh my 
Yeah, not a lot of people know that about that move. Yeah, yeah, it like <laughs> auto tracks. You just like uh, appear over there like now. Yeah, exactly. Oh, crazy stuff. Game five. I was actually that was looking um, a lot more favored towards Skittles. Yeah. Um, especially that game before. Oh my goodness, like he won the game before, obviously, but they're running like, it back. Yeah. So the only two, the, the both wins that Zen has are on the stage. I don't know if I want to give it back to Zen. But maybe it's almost like a pride thing for, for Skittles now at this point. I don't know. It could be, yeah. I but I mean, you didn't play bad on it either, so, you know. Yeah. Maybe you got the data you needed, and you're going to come back and, and, and apply that to this stage. I think he was just kind of working, like, a lot harder for the kills at times. Yes. Um, there were very few times where Zen died at, like, 110. Right. Like, he was dying at, like, 150, 160 a lot of the times and Young kind of does struggle to kill so having like the the side blast zone can be nice but what's weird is that skills besides the edge guard uses dare and up air which send up to kill which yeah. so maybe he's just banking on like the the kills horizontally right or maybe i'm reading like, too much into it and they just like this the interactions as they're playing on the stage well, that's why i thought it looked so much better on like battlefield before because oh yeah i forgot about that game because like Tanner was able to. Oh, oh that, that, be it? that might be it. The whole oh my it's god! Certainly it there. Man, then. But like Tanner was able to so much quickly, uh, more able to get two like corner carry combos on Zen and, and find those like arrow into fares at ledge. Whereas like you have so much more stage to kind of like work your way through to find those opportunities. I agree. And and I think that's why there's like so many horizontal options coming out from, from Tanner on this one. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't be surprised if, if Zen was banning um, a FD. Battlefield, yeah. Battlefield FD, maybe, yeah. yeah. Um, I mean, I don't think either of these guys would want to go to Smashville. Well, regardless, Zen right now in a very, very good position, sitting pretty for sure. 84%, it's going to be a little bit longer before uh, Skittles is able to find a kill as Young kind of kind of has a, a threshold before he's able to kill. Yeah. Um, but right now, it's looking oh. really good. Not quite oh, killing. Oh, my goodness, yeah. Good up B and... Oh, Ooh, we need the air dodge. Ooh, good change of direction for Zen there. Yeah. Tanner was hoping for for him to come into the center stage, and then he just doesn't. He makes that adjustment. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Pancake! Pancaking! Pancake at you, more like. Right. Real. <laughs> Alolan Raichu. <laughs> wow, just back, raw back air killing from center stage? Yeah, I don't see what that the heck? A whole lot. Um, well, I'm sure uh, Skittles is happy to have that stock over with. Yeah. 20, he's only at 26%, but that felt like it went on for like a much higher percent yeah. than it needed to, than it did. Um, Ooh, getting Ooh. some platform assist. Oh my goodness, that would have been nice. Been neat smash worthy almost. Yeah, for sure. Oh, Ooh. nice. Who's he cooking? What was he cooking? <laughs> Does he know? Dead even right now. Mm -hmm. Both of them just trying to inch their way in against the other. Uh, t don't can be so annoying to deal with. Yeah. Because it's like, <laughs> it, the way it travels, you have to either have to shield it or it like jump. Yeah. And both of that that just becomes like 50 what, 50 how Pikachu yeah. wants to punish that option. It, exactly. Like Zen wants you to, to full hop there. Because he wants to find that sphere right here. Right. And then we've seen it kind of fish for it. Finds that air dodge and hits a forward smash. Oh, I thought he was gonna go for it again. Oh boomerang. Snare. Looking for the ring again. And just going back to center stage. Um you don't want to play that reversal game Ooh. off stage and That would have been sick. Right? Nice. Fair. Gonna take Jump it, yeah. Three, yep. The rage helps too. It can never hurt. Definitely. But uh, definitely kill percent. Pikachu can definitely kill here. Good edge guard. Yeah. Fair too. Especially if those platforms move back in. Or dash attack. And that's no jump for Skittles. Um, oh, nice yeah. job finding that landing for Zen. And Zen has been really good about punishing the landings from Skittles. Yeah. Uh, he's been really aggressive with the landings. Yeah. And Zen kind of just either like fades back, uh, dashes back, or just kind of like punishes it. Like just raw. Just like beats the hitbox. Yeah. Okay. A little bit of a cute combo going on. Here's oh the my early goodness. strings. 
88 damage off of two little strings. And I think this might be what Skittles needed here yeah. if he wants to close out this set. Uh, this scary position to be in if you're Pikachu because now Young Link oh. can just kind of set up shop at the edge of the stage or in center. There's really nothing that's uh, stopping Skittles from just like dancing all over him. And I, I like how Tanner just decided not to get hit anymore. Oh yeah, for like, real. Like he just went into that mode. He's just like, ah, I don't like getting hit anymore. Oh, I know, right? <laughs> yeah, he's really good at just like playing so like passively, but still like hitting hard when he gets kind of like, like that yeah. one off it. Oh my whoa, gosh, whoa, 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 big whoa. damage from Zenit. If that had sent the other way, it might have been the stock. I know, rage again, rage. Oh, this is now scary. Skittles keeping cool right yeah. now. And Zen also just playing the same game plan. Neither of them deviating from this game plan right now. It's just a matter of percents. It's the only Whoa. difference. Whoa! Not doing the down smash out of that drag down. Whoa. I don't yeah. know if he missed it or if he knows something I don't. Does he know? Does, does he know? Oh, I thought he was the down smash. Good, mm. ooh. Good jump there from Zen, avoiding that up air. Oh, this is so scary. I can't believe this is game five. They're yeah. just playing so level-headedly right now. This is kind of the sweet spot where an arrow will definitely lead to a kill on a fair. I so know. I think that's why we see. Oh! There it is. There, Ooh. yes. Good stuff. Wow. Holy Skittles Lord. clutching it out at the end. <laughs> yeah, no. Super scary. Like, I, I was like. Yeah, my heart was, was tensing pounding. up a little bit. Right. But, Ooh. oh, goodness. They're very good at just like staying calm, playing the game plan. And I really, again, I didn't see a whole lot of deviation from the game plan. It's just yeah. that both of the. Like every game, the players would just like, well, like I have my game plan and it worked in this instance, so it's going to keep working for the rest of this game. So this game's going to be mine. Yes. And then it just kind of came down to um, Skittles just like playing a little bit more slippery than, than yes. Zen was able to, just avoiding a lot of stuff that Zen was trying to do for sure. previous game plan. But again, that's it's good because he wasn't like um, trying to force it in earlier games. Like he right. was able to like you know figure out how the interaction works and then. Do something else off of yeah, it for it's, this it's, last game. It's almost as if he used those like first two stocks against Zen to like really complete the download before he went into that slippery mode. Mm, yeah. So that he's not like he's he's taking as much advantage of Zen's game plan as he possibly can in that last stock right. before he can adjust. 